So here we are, visitor center. We're trapped. Well, we're tra well, we're trapped. Yeah, we are trapped. Above ground. They can't get to us, but we also don't have water. We left that back there. Hey, Clementine. Hey. How's he doing? Okay, it is a boy. He's perfect. Who's a perfect little man? Who's the most perfect little man in the whole world? You are. That's uh, right. I know it's not you true, are. but... He looks like Alvin. You think so? Definitely. Thank you. <coughs> I'm fine, I'm fine. I just wish I could get warm. Clem, why don't you give her that coat we found? Sorry, you know, about the color. You really think I care about that? <laughs> Do you want to hold him? Could I? Of course. Your family. Here. <laughs> Here, let me take him. You both should rest. Especially you. When's the last time you slept, Kenny? Oh, about two years ago. <laughs> I'm fine. Plus, somebody's gotta watch you while Mama gets her beauty sleep. You never forget that smell. Listen, I'm sorry. I've got to go. Where are you going to go? Come on. The longer I stay, the harder it'll be. Go. Go where? Just... away. Okay? You know, Jamie, Sarah. I'm not going to stick around and... and watch it happen to you two. You know the score. You're a smart kid. But I thought you believed in me. I do. But give it enough time, and everyone's luck runs out. Listen, when the shit hits the fan, because it always does, remember that you can make it on your own. It's not an option for everyone. If things start heading south, don't let them drag you down with them. You don't owe them anything. It's not about that, They'll though. They'll make you like... feel like you do. Like it's all one happy family. And when push comes to shove, you'll see. I owe these people everything. They've kept me safe, looked out for me. I wouldn't be here without them. Well, they can't keep you safe forever. No one is safe forever. You take care of yourself. I mean that. Here. Versatility is not overrated. Thanks. Yeah. I, uh... I gotta go. You'd be asleep by now. You okay? No. I guess we all got stuff on our minds. <sighs> the temperature's dropping. We're low on food. I think we gotta stay put for a while. You know, for Rebecca and the baby. So I'm thinking as soon as it gets light, Jane and I should go explore. 
See if we can find some place to scavenge. Yeah, what? about Jane. Jane left for good. What? When? Just now. No, he's gonna you go serious? run after her. She didn't say anything about leaving to me. What the fuck? And die. Damn it! Hey, keep it down. Sorry. I... Sorry. Just... Jane's gone. Really? Luke? Of all the childish bullshit. Childish? God damn it, Kenny. You know what? Just lay off. No. You put our lives, this baby's life at risk, so you two could roll around like fucking teenagers. Look, I made a mistake, all right? No, it's not all right. What do you want from me? You guys are both acting like jerks. All you guys do is fight. Look, I'm sorry, okay? I fucked up. But you know what, Jane? She made an offer, and Jesus Christ, I needed it, okay? I mean, look around you, okay? Everything is shit. So forgive me for wanting to enjoy one moment of something else. Fine, but this baby, he's what matters now, got it? So get your shit Honey, together. Where's my baby? Is everything all right? Everything is fine. We're gonna need a good place to raise him, which ain't here. We gotta push on. We head north, get to Wellington. That's our best shot. There's a town across the river. It might be safe there. Or at least it might be a good stop on the way. Kenny! I'm sorry. Clem's got a point. That could be a whole town full of supplies, and not that far from here. Whole lot better than here, anyway. Looks like that's our best bet. We need to get on the road as soon as possible. We leave at first light. Whoa, whoa! What are you talking about? <coughs> Rebecca needs rest. A few days, at, at the least. We've got that baby formula. And it won't help the rest of us. Now what about shelter? We'll freeze out here. Kenny's right. We should leave in the morning. Rebecca is not in any condition to travel. I'll be fine. If there's a chance there's food, we have to yeah, risk we it. Can't, like, we can't stay here. That's okay, just a fact. Okay, fine, if that's what you want. Look, we should all try to get some sleep. It's been a long day. that jacket on sorry okay Bex it's gonna be all right Exhausted. We all are. I can keep going. We should have stayed put. We should have stayed put until she was in better shape. She wasn't gonna get no better back there. We gotta find food. Get her someplace warm. This looked like someplace warm to you? We could still turn back. That's not an option. Everybody hang in there. We gotta keep moving if we're gonna make it to that town before nightfall. You don't even listen to anyone else. You just go on barking orders. You gotta lighten up, okay? You're pushing them too hard. I'm just doing what has to be done, like always. Keeping people alive. You're not helping anything by arguing. Don't forget, you agreed with me last night that we should get moving as quick as possible. Agreed, but you don't need to be a dick. Uh, oh, uh, oh shit. Oh. oh here. It's a place to sit. Yeah, uh, she is like Rebecca, let me take the baby. Oh. He's okay. I've got him. No. You rest for a minute. I'll wash him. Back off, Kenny. She said she doesn't want you to take the baby. Don't be weird about it, okay? That's not being weird. I ain't Shh. being weird about it. Yeah, you kinda have been. And not just right now. Kenny knows what he's doing. 
He's been a dad before. That's not the part I was concerned about. Hello? What? What is this? Hey, it's Arvo. Is that Arvo? Minas Lishna! Yep, that's Arvo. Arvo? Arvo? Jane and I met him on the observation deck. Before everyone else Now they'd be pissed we didn't tell them. You know this son of a bitch? Well, what's he want? He doesn't look like much. That ain't the point. Hello? Please? I don't like this. He has a sick sister. They might be in trouble. <sighs> All right. Hello. Your name is Clementine. Yes? Hi, Arvo. These are your friends? I'm hoping you can help me now, not like before. All of you can help. How is your sister doing? Sister? Not so good. I need, uh, uh things for bandages. I need bandages. Are you hurt? No. Nikaki Aruji! Nikaki Aruji! Nikaki Aruji! Fuck! Arvo. Это они? Да. Это они. Скажи им, чтобы они поставили их оружие на пол, и что мы забираем все, что они имеют. Что ты хочешь, чтобы я взял? Откуда я знаю? Чтобы у них не было. Может быть, у них есть патроны. We don't want any trouble. I told them you are the ones who robbed me. They think it's funny that you're just a little girl. Robbed? And they want you and your friends to put down the guns, so we can take your things. Whoa, whoa, hang on now. What the hell? Why get excited? Clementine, you robbed this guy? It wasn't me who took your stuff. It was Jane. It, it wasn't any of us. Jane. Uh, I kind of feel bad. I Where's the other the one? There, but... Что происходит? Их было двое раньше. I do not see a woman who was with you. Where is she hiding? What's going on? She's gone. She left the group. It's a trap. I know it. Они прячутся. Я знаю, что они прячутся. Oh God. This can be easy for you. Arvo, скажи, чтобы они опустили оружие. All of you, just put your guns down. This will be fine. Find my ass. Слушай, Arvo. Почему они не слушают? Я пытаюсь. Тогда старайся сильнее. Please, tell them not to shoot. Опусти оружие сейчас. Ай, ай. Арва, что происходит здесь? The fuck is she saying? Играйся со мной. Why get excited? I will not let them touch that bagel. Опусти. You have a baby with you? Yeah, no shit, Arva. У них родничковый ребенок. Если ты знаешь, что хорошо до тебя, опусти оружие сейчас. И слишком много. Бурико, отойди. Drop that now or I'm gonna fucking shoot it. I'll do it. Drop it. Drop it. Don't fucking, don't move. I said don't move. Ты хочешь умереть? Не зми меня. Ты думаешь, что я хороший мужик? Бурико, Бурико, остановись. Опусти оружие. Тебе не зачем это делать. Не стреляйте. Oh, she turned. Help! Rebecca, no! No! Oh! Oh shit! Oh! Wah! Oh my god. Are you sure? <sighs> that is really pissing me off right now. Oh my god. God damn it. Ah, oh, shit. Well, I'm officially rattled, so there's that. Uh, wow. Let's talk about some of these decisions. So, uh, pretty interesting. This is 
it's interesting. There's about 50-50 on almost all of these. So, uh, we saved Sarah at the trailer park. I guess, what, was she going to die either way then? So if we didn't save her, she dies maybe? or she, And then we save her and then she still died. Um, robbing Arvo, we did not. I'm not sure if that helped us or not. We 50% volunteered to crawl through. We knew what was going to happen, but it's all good. Held the baby. Why not? And then survivalism did not shoot Rebecca. I assume if we would have shot, the exact same thing would have happened. So I'm not sure what kind of impact that's going to have, if any. The only one here that I see being a major like issue in the future is robbing Arvo because we didn't. We didn't. But I mean, and Jane's not here to for them to be pissed at, but he would still be pissed at me. So I'm not really sure. But uh, it was interesting, this episode. I would say it was a little bit... Uh, it was probably one of the weaker episodes. I liked... The, I think the, the tension in the story is getting really, really good, actually. But uh, just from, like, um, making really tough decisions and a gameplay perspective, I don't think it's been as strong as the previous ones have been. And there's been a lot of, like, when we were in the museum, it was just, like, go and read all these signs. It was kind of like, well why like what's the point of that and then uh there was another part i think it was with it was with jane i can't remember but it was like it was just kind of like redundant activities it didn't really help anything and uh kind of a bummer like that but the story i gotta say like i'm totally in and i really want to figure out what's going on next but uh we're gonna have another couple of months wait here and then we can finally figure out what the hell Oh, Telltale. You're not good for my heart. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. I had a ton of fun still. Uh, just following the story now, I'm like, I need to know what happens. We got another episode, and I don't know if there's been, like, a season three announced or if, if they're going to do one, but it's, uh, it's a pretty good series, and I'm really intrigued by what they're doing. So hopefully they round it out nicely, and hopefully things go well for us. What I think is crazy is she just turned. Like, that's pretty nutty. Gave birth and then turned. Whoa. Um, yeah. Crazy. Thanks, guys. We will uh, see you next time. I'm going to fade things out here. And uh, thank you. Bye.